Yo, what is going on, Dark Nation? It's your boy, Dark Me, I'm here. And I've been playing a bit of the Infinite Warfare beta. Well, I say a bit, but it's been like about 11 hours I've played of it so far, and I've still got a few more days to play of it. Um, I'm already max rank that you can get to, that it's been capped off to, and that's 30, so... Hopefully they'll raise the, um... Hopefully they'll raise the cap, because then you can unlock more um, weapons and stuff, so you can try it out before the actual full game comes out. Because um, I'd like to get as much gameplay and um, my opinions on each weapon for you guys. Um, so I just thought I'd take the time in this video to um, go over what I really like about this game um, so far from the beta. Um, so first of all will be the movement system. I really like the movement system in this game because it's very similar to Black Ops 3 and it's really easy to get used to. Say like on my first game, it only took me around a minute or so um, to get used to the ever so similar movement system from Black Ops 3. Like it does vary because of the um, the boost doesn't go as far um, as I'd like it to do like in Black Ops 3 and you don't slide as far. But once you get that down, um, it's basically the same. Um, and I think second of all, I'm going to move on to the rigs. And I can tell you now that my favourite rig is the um, the claw. Because um, I feel like it drops people like really fast. I think it fires two bullets in 0.2 seconds in all directions. Um, and basically whatever's on your screen is going to die. And so that's why I think it's my favourite. And when you like zoom in with it, um, it also keeps it really like a tight hip fire spread. Like you're not aiming down sight, but you're not hip firing. It's like a nice in between where you're hitting most of your shots. And um, excelling onto the um, fact that you kill really people really fast with the rigs, you also kill people really fast with the base weapons like the MV4. Um, I think I'm using the exalted um, variant of this weapon uh, right now. Um, and I really, really like this variant because I feel like it drops people how fast I expect them to die. Um, and I know how fast people should die in this game. I feel like the response time to me shooting someone and them dying is perfect. Like, when I get a kill, I know that's how fast I'm going to die. But in other Call of Duty's, it varies due to like various server issues and flat out. But I don't think this game has that in the beta, so... It's really good to know you're going to die as fast as you're killing people because it kind of balances it out. And the score streaks especially, like I don't find them really difficult to earn, but I always like to run hardline so I can keep them rolling and rolling. Um, I think my favourite score streak in this game is the Warden because they're like easy to get because it's only 11 kills and run that with hardline it's like 9 I think. Um, I'll probably do the maths later and figure out that I'm wrong, but it's like nine, so um, yeah, basically that's about it for the um, score streaks. But I just want to let you guys know that there will be much more gameplay um, of this game coming out in the re in the next couple of days, so like Wednesday and Sunday. They'll, that'll mostly be Infinite Warfare beta gameplay. Even though the beta is going to end by Wednesday, because I've got like loads of gameplay to share with you guys. And this gameplay is from the game where I got to rank um, 30, which is the max rank. Um, I just want to let you know where this is from. I've got a couple quad feeds to show you guys, and five man on screens, like that. Um, but I think I'm going to leave that to a later date, because um, I think the gameplay from this game is about to run out soon. So I'm going to let you guys enjoy that. It's B Boy Dark Mayhem. Take it easy. Peace.